Yeah, welcome back to Minecraft. It's been a long time since I played. I've never seen any of that stuff before. So let's see if we can find a nice server. Okay, what the hell is this? This looks like some kind of factory. Let's take a look around here. And maybe I can switch resolutions to Optifine or something? Oh yeah, this is way better. Cool. So, what is this place? See this thing over here? Maybe it's an old mine shaft? Looks like it. Can I switch resolution again? Oh yes I can! <laughs> this is not the Minecraft I'm used to. Wow, what a progress. Uh, let's find a way in maybe. See what this is all about. Okay. Uh, is this safe? Okay, that's water. Hope this still works in Minecraft. Yep, does. I survived. Nice. Uh, Simon Danny, mine, September 5th till January 17th. In Dusseldorf, really? That's like a minecart, maybe. Oh, I really missed this. <laughs> um. Where does this lead us? Oh, okay. Whoa, what the hell is this? <laughs> Looks like a giant flying machine or something. Uh, can I get... It? Oh, yes, I can. I think this is how you turn it on. Oh, it's a tunnel bore machine. Awesome. Whoa, and the flying machine back there. Let's get out of here and take a closer look. <laughs> oh, and I already got a block. Cool. Okay, so there's a TNT duper. And then what is back here? This looks like the timer. So this goes back and forth and sets the time to launch the TNT in front. Nice. And then everything is destroyed. Cool. Oh, lava. We don't want to get near that. Okay. Well, look how much progress it did already. This is like 20 blocks already. So, what is this over here? This looks like some exhibition. Let's ask Simon Danny what this is about. Well, the thing is, like, the whole, the whole cage is based on a drawing mm -hmm. um, that comes from a patent that Amazon.com filed in 2016 um, for a cage that would contain a worker. So actually, these numbers that are on this cage are from the drawing, like a, mm -hmm. a relic from the drawing that's in the document of the patent. So Amazon has this incredible warehouse where they have like these shelves which are moved around on these little robot units. Um, and uh, and they, they actually no people are allowed into that area because it's quite dangerous. These things are kind of algorithmically controlled. Um, <laughs> and then uh, they, they, this was a design so that you could put a human into that system. And I was like, oh my God, that's like the most kind of amazingly poetic thing about man and machine automation and kind of control and power structures and all those things. Yeah, so I mean, the rest of the rooms ha are kind of like a, a mess about, almost like a, like a, um, what do you call it? A uh, trade fair. Yeah, like a trade fair, exactly. Yeah. Um, and I've made kind of uh, copies of um, nice. machines that are used in making mining happen today. Um, this looks like some courtroom sketches. 
So I've called a, a courtroom sketch artist in Australia um, who has been working in the Brisbane High Courts for 30 years. Um, mm -hmm. And she and I uh, talked about making drawings as if the people that owned these mining companies would be on trial uh, for um, what they do to the world, you know? Mm -hmm. um, and so she made these beautiful drawings um, of like, yeah, the people that own those companies as if they were on trial, kind of <gasps> like, as, you know, looking guilty and, and looking defensive and um, something that actually probably, unfortunately, will never happen. And then there's a game here, Squatton Extractor. So I made this board game as a part of um, of the show, as a kind of way to do a fun catalog, you know. So we, we went ahead and made a, a kind of a version of an existing, very famous Australian game uh, called Squatter, which is like this crazy sheep farming game. And I subbed out the sheep farming narrative um, and instead put in this uh, story about, yeah, how uh, a, a kind of... Uh, platform capitalist uh, like platform will kind of go and uh, l you know use all your data and put it on the cloud yeah okay well I like it exit okay exit through the gift shop I guess with the gift shop <laughs> no gift shop to be seen uh, can we take a mine card with us <laughs> oh yes <laughs> okay bring that to my family and friends have a minecart in your living room. <laughs> yeah, so this has been Minecraft. <laughs> Hope you liked this video. If it did, please leave a like. Maybe visit the exhibition in Düsseldorf. It's open till January 17th. If you can't get to Düsseldorf due to Corona, link below in the description for the Minecraft server. If you know a server where I could join with active players that actually talk English and maybe even YouTubers, this would be awesome. This is what's keeping me from playing Minecraft again, really. And maybe the mod installation. <laughs> okay, anyway, see ya. Thanks for watching.